Sometime back, I got a comment on my Instagram asking me how my belief in God helped me change my life and become a senior software engineer. I went from a kid born in a war zone, moving to Europe to escape all this conflict for our survival, to a place where I didn't know the language, the culture, I went to school, I was lost at the beginning, I was a failure, honestly, I was failing school, to completely shifting my life around, moving to the US, getting a master's degree, finding a six-figure job, becoming a software engineer, then moving to New York, and now working as a senior software engineer on top of the Empire State Building. If I have to think about this question, just the importance that God had throughout this whole journey, it's actually very difficult even to put into words just the importance. I was kind of thinking, like, when I got this question, I was like, what the heck, actually, it's very difficult to answer just the magnitude of what it represents. And if I have to put it into a simple example, I'll probably say this. Imagine if two people are thrown in an empty field. One of them is not told anything. He's just there, he's lost, he doesn't know what he's supposed to do, he's just in this field and he's supposed to survive, figure out what he's supposed to do. The other one though, he is given a specific set of instructions. He's given what is the objective that he's supposed to reach, where he's supposed to go, he's given the map of what he's supposed to follow. And then he's given reassurance that it's gonna be okay, that the journey is gonna be difficult, that he's gonna face hardships and challenges, but ultimately, as long as he follows the plan, as long as he trusts, that map that he's given, things will be okay. Who do you think out of those two people has a higher likelihood of reaching this end, this dream destination where they want to be? That's basically the same way as I compare myself, having my belief in God, having my religion, and me not having it. And it's kind of difficult maybe for some of you guys to, to understand it because when you haven't experienced something, when you haven't tasted something, you don't know what it is to have it, right? It's kind of like this example with the guy who is in that empty field and he doesn't have a map. Well, he doesn't know what he's missing out. He, For him, the reality of life is just the reality that he's experiencing. He doesn't know what it's like to have the map. He doesn't know this entire different human experience that exists. Throughout my journey, there are many moments where I had actually close to a breakdown, right? When, when you move to a completely different continent, when you lose everything you have, all the people, your family is far away from you, you, it's very easy to get lost. It's very easy to go off rails. And I had many moments like that where I was close to, to having a breakdown. But what helped me at those moments is realizing that actually results, they don't depend on me. Results are from God. And my job is just to do the action. My job is just to do the effort. The effort though is under my control. You can always control how much effort you put in, in a test, to prepare for an interview, to work on a project. You can always control that. You don't control the outcome. You don't control whether you succeed at the exam, whether you get the job that you want, whether you get the results that you want. You cannot control this because they depend on God. But when you shift your mindset and realize this, it removes so much pressure from your life and it makes your entire energy focus just on the variables that you can control. To me, to come back to the main question of the video, this is the answer. This is what the belief in God gives me to my life throughout this journey, this is what it has brought me. It brought me the sense of clarity and the sense of peace. Now, having this mindset would have not been useful for me if I was just sitting and doing nothing about it, if I was just praying and not taking any actions. That's why I spend a long time documenting a complete strategy, a complete roadmap that you guys can take if you want to reach a similar objective. The video is available right here. I highly recommend you check it out.